Okay, I might actually like talk about the dream I had. Uh, right. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in a tub, and next to me... Chris? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seems so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. We'll find her. Oh, okay. We trained with Siri, but now she's gone. Damn dream. I went and found Siri. And then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. Siri in my dreams, I mean she's in danger. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri'd appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Time to go. Be dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Oh, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. <laughs> we must meet soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be honest with this dude. I'm good. Give give all the information I can. It was a stuffed unicorn. We used it as a bed once. Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. In certain situations. Mm. The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait, hear that? Oh, here we go. Right, monsters, life on the continent and in the village. Ours is nasty, brutus, and short. War lies waste to the land that knows its bears live in fear of the countless monsters lurking outside every town and village. Monsters are shown with a silver health bar above their heads, indicating that you should fight them with your silver sword. Alright, let's get the silver sword out. We got the silver sword out? Cool. Right, here we go. Oh god. Alright, let's try let's, let's try a strong attack. Come on. Bloody yeah, they're fast. Striking opponents oh yep. It's set on business use for those forms for anything. Okay. Cool. When armies pass necrophages. Could generate uh, eating or drinking or meditate for at least one hour. While playing on the blood and broken bones and death march difficulties and Meditation does not regenerate. Okay, well, we're not on that. Food and drink can be placed in your consumers. It's not up or down to consume them. Um, okay, cool. That was pretty exciting. I wonder, I don't know if day and night just triggers automatically. It'd be kind of cool if it does, but is that sun going down? Anyway, don't, don't look at the sun for too long, you know. That's uh, it's not good for your eyes. Alright. Put the sword away. Oh yeah. 
No, 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 no. Go on. Good. Okay, Hellboy is just going to keep taking swords out. Oh, what's this? Bandits call themselves to mail to... Demiria's soldiers are hiding in nearby woods. They have been declared outlaws and a threat to the Empire's, Emperor's subjects. Okay. So I guess, like, stuff like this is, what would you call, like, side missions and bounties. So we'll look for these bandits, and when we find these bandits, we're gonna, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to deal with them. Hmm. Well, I see the time is like 4.59 a.m. Oh, no, it's 5 a.m. Okay, so the time does go. Witches spend most of their time on the road in search of the next contract. They must trek across wild, wide valleys, climb over high mountain peaks, and trudge through thick bogs. Okay. Well, at least I've got my horse. Uh, to have... Okay, oh, so you can call for the horse as well. That's nice. tell you about this sorcerer I knew couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures because you can brew potions from their blood <laughs> no because by eating rotting corpses they prevent epidemics hmm. did he know they eat the living as well no really upset him too his theory no, is not exactly going our way we have a side the northern realms Radovid's realms don't you mean Tamaria and Edern are no more Radovid's pledge to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. Alright, let's have a little look. Uh, right. Bearing the bodies of hanged Sirtis and rebels is hereby strictly forbidden. Anyone caught trying to cut down hanging corpse will be executed. Okay. Do I? Yeah. No. All right. I can't re. I can't cut them down. That's sad. We need to break the law. What the hell is this? Gavin ingredients. Ooh. A bit of mushroom, eh? Come over here, horse. But <laughs> pressing R three apparently calls you over. No. Come here. Come here, Roach, or whatever your bloody name is. Oi. R3. Oh, never mind. Just have to do it the old fashioned way. Oh, look at that gallop. Hey there. Going up you right, mate? Okay. Okay, I guess just upset over um, not being able to cut down these bodies. Slow now. Whoa. Oh god. Someone left the oven on. A nice little village. Red, red markers on my thing. What the hell are those? What the heck's that? Alright. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go, let's go. I don't think we're ready to take on bloody Avatar people. Some time later. We going? More ghouls. <laughs> Slap that ass. Oh no, this, this is a different monster. Bit of Final Fantasy. Thank God that's not my horse. Hey. 
have to go. Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us a thing. We could use a few crowns. Oh... Oh, we could get money later on, I guess. But then my my guy did get hurt. You know what well, would be nice? You don't owe us a thing. You don't owe us anything. We were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there. Muddled. You seek someone? Yeah, a woman. Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But there's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there. This is the innkeep's my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's All right. That, that horse just appeared out of nowhere. That is the ghost horse. <laughs> My horse is the ghost horse. Bloody hell. Just jumped from the sky. Innkeeper and say, your, your weird cousin with the stupid haircut, Bram, whatever his name was, Said, uh, said we could have a nice little sleep. Oh my god, bloodshed. Well, at least we've got some bread and water as well. Okay, ghost horse. Okay. okay, hold X without steering. Oh, wow. So, a griffin this close to the village. Strange. My god, exactly. In the forest of the mountain, sure, but here, near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. Yeah, so basically I'm just holding X, and if the horse follows the path, that's, that's pretty amazing. I don't know if that's been done before. Okay, so, populated areas. We're nearing a village. Don't disturb. Ah, uh, you know, I'm gonna try and read it as the Witcher. You're near in a village. Don't disturb the peace. Remember, town guards and hired watchmen won't tolerate theft, and also won't look kindly on your so <laughs> accusing others. Local residents often erect notice boards in these settlements, such as villages and cities. These are marked that on your map. Examine them to learn about contracts. Work for witches and local happenings. Out of the way, kid. Oh. Horse, no. No horse, this way. That, okay, so they just follow the main road, so you don't. Fair enough. Shut up, woman. Fair enough. Alright. Where's your horse? Slower. Samaria no more, old man. It's stealth card now. My heart it is. Don't take it down. Oh.
witches. I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Then you won't drink at all. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're going to end up killing them. Folk are jumping around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm -hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? Dead. Oh. Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I do? Mm. Okay, uh, shops as well. Okay, it's all good. Looking for a woman. Show me what you got. Pretty busy place. Okay, uh, well, let's keep to the main thing. Looking for a woman. Looking for a woman. Raven haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries. Might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Um, dialogue, uh, ending conversations. Okay. Um, show me what you got. Well, I don't want to buy anything. Let's get more information. Pretty busy place you got. Nations on the move. Some search for kin. Others just want to get out of the way of the armies. They all need food, drink, and a night's rest and warmth. So, war's been good for your trade? Aye, so far. But it'd be best to know peace again. Times like these, you never know what tomorrow will bring. Is there a contract on that griffin? Nay, not at the moment. Used to be. Soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the alderman would start a collection, or go to the lord for help. Now the alderman don't use the privy without a hand. Seems they hanged the lord. So no contract. Shame. We might have done something, but not for free. Thanks. For everything. Uh, there's food and drink on the house, guys. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw. Okay, well, let's go and draw some attention. Damn. Nice house. Look at all that wallpaper.